Hey, you! Let's deal.
Goro. Appear to me, Gorhodron, ancient leader of the warrior caste. Why do you disturb my rest, Guardian? Tell me, what do you desire? The land is plagued by earthquakes. We must do something, or the entire island will sink into the sea. There is nothing left for us to do. The wrath of Adonis has fallen upon Jarkandar to punish the unbelievers. Grant me access to the Temple of Adonis. The temple will remain closed for all eternity. Thus did we in the Council disagree. What is in the Temple of Adonis? My greatest sorrow. My greatest disappointment. Someone has forced his way into the Temple of Adonis. Nonsense. I myself sealed the door. It is impossible to pass. Indeed. The praised wisdom of the ancestors is truly overwhelming. A man of your standing does not speak to me thus. I cannot free myself of the impression that you are not the one you pretend to be. If you require my aid, you must first prove yourself to me. Answer my question so that I may be sure that I do not reveal myself to strangers. Ask away. I am Quahogran, the old warlord of Jakendar. You have woken me. To which caste of Jakendar do you belong? The Guardians of the Dead. The abilities of a guardian of the dead would have allowed you to waken me, that is true. If you are truly the one you claim to be, you will be able to answer all of my questions. Except for one. Who once protected the people of Jarkandar from enemy attacks? The warrior cast. Who can give me a direct order? The priests. Who brought the evil upon us? The warrior cast. Who has the final word in the Council of Five? The scholars. Who alleviates suffering and attends to the ill? The healers. Who seal the portal to guard the world from evil? I don't know. Good. I trust you and shall grant you my aid. Now listen here. A truly evil fellow has gained access to the Temple of Adonis. If you don't let me into the temple right now, it will probably be too late and everything will go down the drain. That cannot be. The High Priest Kandiman and I are the only ones in Jarkandar who know how to open the gate to Adonis's temple. Well, then your pal Cardamon must have blabbed. I'm telling you the gate was open. I saw it myself. Well, I should hope so. Take then the password. It is written on this stone tablet. Speak the words at the sealed gate of the temple, and it will open. My time is done. Alas, I can no longer help you. But remember, beware the chambers of Adonis. Else your death is certain. Wait, what about the chambers? My strength is failing. Farewell. We shall meet again in the realm 
Hey, you! I've talked to Kor Hodron. Then you were really able to waken him from the realm of the dead? That's unbelievable. I am more and more amazed by these builders. Who knows what they could have achieved if they still existed today? What did the ghost say? He gave me something that will let me get into the Temple of Adenos. Then go straight to Satyrus. He will certainly be interested in what you have to say. problem with the temple gate is solved. Has the spirit spoken? Yes, he has. Then you know how to get into the temple. Correct. And he also told me what is in the temple. He spoke of a mighty sword and the chambers of Adonos. By Adonos, what fools we are. How could we have been so naive? The hints in the records. This sword can only be the claw of Beliar. We must get through those chambers as soon as possible and take possession of the weapon. What are the chambers of Adnos? We now know that the entrance is not the only obstacle that prevents us from entering the depths of the temple. In the temple itself, there are three chambers which are meant to deter all intruders. The colored relics of the builders are the key. Only if we gather all the relics and solve their riddles will we enter the inner sanctum of the temple. I don't know whether Raven was able to decipher the riddles of the temple, but if that is the case, we have a big problem. What is the Claw of Beliar? It is the incarnation of evil. Beliar himself created it. Whoever bears it possesses a terrible tool of destruction. The more powerful the bearer is, 
the mightier the power of the claw. Only someone who is strong of spirit and steadfast in his faith can withstand its spell. Now it is clear to me why the builders sealed off this valley. They brought this weapon of evil into their city and fell under its power. These arrogant fools destroyed one another out of greed. The cruelty knew no end until Adonis's wrath swept across the land and sank everything into the sea. Indeed, the creators of the portal did well to hide these things from the rest of the world. And what a tragic end for such a wonderful culture. Do you realize the urgency of our mission now? Raven is a strong fighter and is blinded by his lust for power. In his hand, the claw will be an instrument of destruction. He must not get the weapon or we shall all be lost. What exactly do I do with the relics in the temple? We know too little. However, it is to be hoped that you'll recognize their significance once you're in the temple. I'm sorry that I can't tell you more. It's all up to you now. Take the relics and make your way immediately to the temple. May Adonos be merciful and protect us all. Perhaps it is not yet too late. May Adonos protect you. I think I've found something. I think I've found something.
How's it going? What do you want? Have you got anything to say to me? If not, you can just go away. Otherwise, my friend will make mincemeat of you. So what is it? They say you have some interesting wares to offer. So what? Esteban wants to jerk me around, eh? I do all the work and hide away here for days in this miserable hole. And he just sends someone to fetch the stuff? I'm not a warehouse. Yeah, and? That isn't my problem. But I'm making it your problem. You want the delivery? Fine. You can pay for it. Get the gold from Esteban or Raven or I don't know where. I don't care. Whoever wants these goods will pay for them. Show me what you have. I don't come from Esteban. Oh? Well then. Hey, just a moment. Hold still for a second. You have a critter on your shoulder. about picking locks.
Don't you want to leave? Of course we do. We're only waiting for the right moment. Esteban is dead. Really? Man, that's lucky. Who did it? Well, let's just say someone you know. Thanks for coming to me. Now I can go back to the camp. I have your package. Indeed? What about Juan? He's dead. Good. Then he can't cause me any more trouble. As far as you are concerned, I have a pretty good relationship with Huno. I'll see to it that you get your armor cheap from now on. Also, I'll give you one of my weapons. One hand washes the other. That hasn't changed since back then. Everything else all right with you? I just want to do my job, man. I have the steel. And? Was Juan there too? He was. I knew it. That rat Esteban was behind it. You're all right. To be honest, I hadn't expected this from you. Yeah. Take this as a reward. Completely. I'd have done it differently. I know who murdered Angus and Hank. I don't care who murdered them. What about my grog? Don't tell me that. About that grog. Here's your twenty bottles. What? Really? Just like that? Well. Okay. I'll pay for them. Haven't you got anything more interesting than gold? Hmm. Let's see, I've got this ring here. I won it gambling in a filthy dockside tavern years ago. Back then, the guy told me it was magic. No idea whether that's true. Maybe you want that instead of money. You listen to the wrong people. Give me the money. All right. It's a bad 
business. That's not what I heard. I know who murdered Angus and Hank. Who? Who did it? His name is Juan. He's one of the bandits. You've got to do that bastard in, do you hear me? He must not get away with this. Juan is history. And? Did he suffer? Come off it, kid. Oh, well. Just as long as you killed the swine. The bandits have found a gold mine. I knew it. That's why they came here. Nobody would volunteer to live in this monster-ridden bog. Good work. Here, I've got something for you. I agree with you completely. I'm not telling you anything new. That's not what I heard.